So a couple guys asked me um, what I do to take care of my bike because it runs so flawlessly. And I constantly brag about how many hours I have on the motor and it's all stock and I haven't had any issues. And so what do I do? So I'm gonna tell you my secret of how I have 350, whatever the million hours on this bike and, I, uh, and what I do to, to keep it running because I haven't had to replace anything in the engine. Okay, here I go. Here's my routine. Really simple. I do all to keep this bike running really i mean compared to most guys it's next to nothing i change the oil every five good rides every five hard rides so if i'm screwing around in the yard and stuff that's not a ride i could do that 10 times and it would, that would be a ride but five hard rides and that's all i do after five i don't do the filters i don't do anything else that's it that just just do oil the next five rides so now at 10 rides that's when i do oil both oil filters and the air filters then at 15 rides, I just do the oil again. And that's it, that's, just my, that's my oil routine. It seems to work. That's when my oil is starting to get dirty. I don't even change it if I submerge the bike. Like, unless I submerge it really bad, but if it's really wet ride and it's going down in bogs and shit, it's probably ride three. I'll wait a couple more rides and I'll change it and it's usually fine. There's, I've never had any issues. Probably stupid, but you know, whatever most shit I do is stupid. And then I, I do uh, put chain wax on every ride though. I. I might try to not use it and see how long a chain lasts. Who knows, you know? I, when I first started riding, I'd forget to put it on all the time and that chain lasts just as long as this one has. So, yeah, that's all I do there. And uh, I don't grease shit. I mean, <laughs> the only thing I've greased is the rear axle and the wheel bearings. When I, when I have to take a tire off, I'll grease the axle and put it back on. That's quick and easy. And when I'm doing wheel bearings, obviously you have to pack them. But but that's it, man. I, I check eyeball my brake pads and I let them go down to the fucking metal before I change them. <laughs> I'm, I'm cheap. I don't do anything with plastics. I could give a fuck what it looks like. This isn't a beauty contest. So yeah, that's really it. I I don't even check my my coolant. Like it's not it hasn't been an issue at all. Like it you know where's it gonna go unless it steams over. Like my linkage, I haven't pat greased my linkage, done anything with my linkage. My fork oil, haven't changed my fork oil. I have I'm well over 300 hours now on the bike. And everything, my suspension is great. It's fine, as far as I can tell, I don't know. I don't know the difference, I don't jump much, so, you know. Clutch plates, I haven't changed. Uh, you know, but you can feel them going out, and that's when you change them. I guess it's the proactive stuff. Like a lot of guys do a lot of proactive maintenance. I don't, and I haven't had any issues um, ever. If you buy blue, this is what you're going to get because all the guys in our group, save for Panda, whose bike is constantly falling apart. And that's not even fair because Pan well, Panda had, has had some motor issues, but I think he sucks up a lot of water. Anyways, other than Panda, the other 20 odd guys that ride Yamahas all have the same story. Haven't had any issues with their bikes for a million hours. Strawberry Shortface literally didn't even change the oil for 12 years on his bike, I'm not even exaggerating. <laughs> you know, like he'd break it out like six times a year, or I don't know, I don't know how many times he was riding back then, but never changed it. And it still runs, everything's fine. Short Shorts rode his into the dirt before it broke down. I mean, that was really recently too, and that bike's a, what's that, a 1926? What are you on? I'll let my tires go a little bit. I, tires I'll change, but those are pretty good. I could flip those. I'm gonna flip this. Uh, yeah, I don't check rotors, I don't check bolts. I just wait till they fall out. I haven't had any fallout other than some plastics here and there. That doesn't look right. These are all cheap aftermarket plastics. They don't fit right in this shit. Yeah. But I don't care. I don't care what it looks like. You know? I'm not out trying to win a beauty pageant. I'm out there having fun. Oh.
มาลา